the previous lecture about uh, you remember it's nice to meet you right it's nice to meet you to meet you and uh, you remember when we use it when we use it yes your name is I'm saying yes you're saying uh, for the first meeting for example you see you introduce yourself for someone for the first time or that someone introduces himself for you for the first time at the end of the conversation you say oh nice to meet you nice to meet you nice to meet you too and this is or uh, you didn't see your friend for a long time and now we have the opportunity to meet him by coincidence uh, also you can use it nice to meet you nice to meet you uh, the uh, second thing I think uh, what is this you remember what is this what is this? And, uh, this? and this is a question. When we don't know something, we ask about it. What is this? Okay? And usually it is, and this, this means singular, right? Because when we don't know some things, not something, some things, this means plural, we, we can say, what are these? Right, thank you. What are these? And the uh, third thing <coughs> we dealt with is um, it's over there, right? Or over there, over there, over there. And we talked about it uh, when you ask someone, for example, the air conditioner, the split conditioner is over there, right? Yes. When we don't, <coughs> when you know someone or something, and you'd like to uh, to guide your friend or to guide your your, uh, your colleague to, to it and you know you can say oh it's over there you can you can talk to him for example or and we talked about conversations uh, and use of this the last thing was it's interesting you remember yes. it's interesting <coughs> it's uh, interesting and you remember when we use it it's interesting yeah, right, thank you. When we are surprised to see something, yes. oh, it's, it's interesting. Something lovely, something nice, right? We use interesting, yeah. <clears throat> and we, we read some of, uh, I would like two students or three students to write the conversation here on page nine. On page nine, we have Wendy, Helen, uh, and Rex. Two ladies and one gentleman. Uh, Nuruddin, yes, Nuruddin and Dalal. You are Rex, yes, of course, you remember. Dalal and Ala, right? Yes, please <coughs> start. Um, Dalal is Wendy. Yeah. Uh, Ala is Helen. Yeah. And Rex is uh, Nuruddin. Yes, start, Wendy. Yes. Oh. See, I, you see these words, wow, oh, all of these are express surprise, they are expressing surprise, you see? So this is the right position, the right situation in which you can use, oh, it's interesting, it's interesting, okay? You see, wow, oh, <coughs> okay, ah, oh, what's this? It's interesting. Usually we said, we use this phrase, it's interesting with surprise, yeah, okay. Now, uh, there's uh, about this pronunciation, uh, box four, pronunciation plural ending S with, I don't think that you need it. You already know there are three sounds for S, Z, Z, okay? Now, these are, no need to, to come through them. But, <coughs> okay, uh, grammar focus. Grammar focus, okay. We would like to uh, focus now on the, these, the, the, uh, they are, these are, the, the, the use of this, these, it, they, and plurals, and plurals, okay? Just a matter of practice. <coughs> Look at the picture. Yes. There are three clocks. Uh, there are uh, airing, 
three earrings, and let us see how the question is about them. I, I will read, this is a clock. These are clocks. You, you, you notice? Turkey is about the com plural and singular, yes, yes. okay? What is this? It's an earring. What are these? They are earrings. It's, it is, they are, there, they are. Okay, now we have practice. <clears throat> you have pictures now? Yes. And I would like you to complete the sentences according to the picture or the pictures. So, number one is already answered. Uh, what are these? These are keys. Two. Yes, your name? I, yes, I have this. What's? Do you mean what's? The S you know, what's? What are? Yeah, what's is wrong. Good. Yes, I am. What are these? They are map. How oh, map? Map is singular. Maps, right. I mean, it could be singular and plural. Thank you. I, I will explain it. Thank you very much. Uh, yes, Hassan. Again, the map, uh, number two. What is this? It is a map. But what I said is also right, because we can say these are maps, you see? Yes. Maps of different countries. Could be, could be right. Yes. And could be one map, map of the world. Yes. Okay? So it is a map and they are maps. Could be both are right. Is it clear? Yes. Okay. Number three. Yes, your name? Yeah? Ayub, yes, Ayub. Yeah. Uh, they, they are uh, bags. They are bags, or these are bags. In Asah, these are bags. Thank you, Ayub. Number four. Yes, your name? Huda, yes, Huda. Uh, what is this? Yeah. It is a this is a clock. A clock or watch? Watch. Why not clock? Okay, I know you know, but let me explain it, please. Uh, there are there are three names for. See, we have a clock. Uh, we have watch, and we have uh, hour, right? Yes. All of these three are, or have meaning of. They are connected with time. Yes. Right? Why didn't I say uh, this is a clock? A clock is. A clock is a wall clock. This is the name that is used for a clock that is uh, hanged on the wall, right? And even a, a pedestal wall, a kusaat jidariya, hamisam a clock, a pedestal clock, also called a clock. Watch. Good. Hand watch. Hand watch. This is called watch. It is incorrect to say this is uh, a clock. This is a watch. Okay, so the right answer is watch in this exercise. Yes. And our, oh, well, okay. uh, good, it's connected with time. And I, will, I waited for you for two hours. Yes. More two, two o'clock, two clocks or three watches. I want as a mini, connected with time. It's about like three hours, more three watches, what are three clocks? Yes. Okay, is it clear now? Yes. Okay, so the right answer is what is this? It is a watch. watch. Good. Yes. Thank you. Uh, six, number six. Yes, uh, Zaydun. Uh, what is this? This is an umbrella. Good. This is an umbrella. An umbrella. This. What is this? It is an umbrella. The last one. Yes, the last. Uh, an answer. We can say it is or is this. Yeah. Uh, according to it, the answer must be connected with a question. Yeah. If you say, what is this? The most appropriate answer is, it is. Who this is? What is this? Sorry, this is. Yes. This is, yeah. If you say, what are these? These are. What you say, if you say, I know. They are also right. But more accurate and connected with a question is, for example, what is this? This is a, a, a watch. It is a watch. Also, Sorry. right. Both right. But I say most appropriate answer is to be connected with the with the question. And has a question. Yes. This, this is. And so I can. What is this? This is. Yes. 
But if you say it is a watch, it's also okay. Yeah. The last one is six. Yes. Yes. Well, this is Excuse me again. What's this? What's this? This is a sunglass. What's this? Glasses. Uh, yes. Uh, yeah. What are these glasses? They are sunglasses. By the way, it is one piece. I know it's one piece, but it's of of pair pair words. Hi, someone. Pair words. two pieces. Trousers. Where is my trouser? Where are my trousers? Uh, where are the scissors? You know, Mugas? Scissors. Where are the scissors? Not where is the scissors? Two pieces, okay. two pieces when the meat, when uh, a material is consist of two pieces. Yes. Though they unite and become one, but they still, they are more than one. So the sunglasses, what are, well, what are these? These are sunglasses. This is the right answer, okay? These, these are plural, not singular. صحيح نظرات واحدة قطعة واحدة بس two pieces. في عامل معاملة plural. Clear now? Yes. yes. Is it clear now how uh, the question and the answer uh, will be? Yes. Okay. Now when you don't know the name of something, okay, that you know this is used for, this is a machine, used for, for example, cutting bread or cutting clothes. You know, already you know. And the question is, what is this? I told this is a, a machine. Next question, what is it called? <coughs> what is it called? Yes. Okay, I know it's a machine, it's just yes. Okay, so after what is it? Next question, you could. What is it called? So this is, what is this called? What is this called? Okay, so what is this called is used for? To know the name of something. Yeah, okay. So we finished the uh, last lecture's subjects. What's it? Uh, what, what's this called? What's this called? But for example, don't forget the question mark. You know this, a piece used for, I, I, you, you ask a question, what is this? I answer you, this is uh, a piece of wood. Usually we use to uh, explain and write on it, to explain something to the students. Yes. So, okay, I know, but was it, what is it called? Okay, this is the next one, I said, I answer you, this, it's called whiteboard. Okay, so this question, what is this called? What's this called? is used for the names. If I don't know the name, I already know the material. What is the material? What is it? What it is? But I would like to know its name. It's the name. What do you call it? Clear or no? Please, if you don't, uh, ask me. Okay. The question here, see you have two pieces. One is like this. Uh, I want someone to read A. Yes, your name is Dua. Yes, Dua. Please listen to your colleague Dua. Page 10, uh, box 6. Box 6, what is this called? By the way, uh, Dua, excuse me. More English. English. English, in English, one word, yes. English, English, yeah. In American, you say English, dark or English. British say English. Both are correct in English or English, but not English. Yes. And cut it. English or English, yeah. Again, Dua. Yeah. What is this called in English? I don't know. Uh, it's a credit card. 
How do you spell it? Spell that. You know credit card? Yes. Uh, how many of you have uh, credit card? You have one? <coughs> kind of it? Uh, gold. Gold? Yes. Like this? Yes, that is. I don't think so. <laughs> we don't have gold credit card. Uh, Visa, Master, Travel. Like you have one? Yeah? Yeah. No, no, not passport. Credit card, you know? This is used for sh uh, shopping, for example, electronically via internet or. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, so, you have the other picture. Two sticks. You see? Two sticks. I don't know actually their names. <coughs> so, I would like to ask a question. Yes, uh, your name, please? Yes, Ahmed. Read the second. What are these called in English? Yeah. I think they are called chopsticks. Yeah, chopsticks. Yes. How do you spell that? C-A-O-P-S-T-I-C-H-S. -E ah. You, you know chopsticks? Yes. Um, the Chinese use Yeah, the Chinese use them. Chinese, Japanese. I think Indonesian, Korean people also um, for eating. It's like these two two sticks, chopsticks called, yes. made of usually of wood. <coughs> usually they are made of wood, yes. and they I don't know they, how they use them. Yeah. Yeah. Anyone who, who knows too? There's someone from section B who knows how to use them, and she practiced it in front of me. Yeah, two pencils, uh, but how to, to manage it, I don't know. But anyway, it's called chopsticks. They are called, sorry, chopsticks. They use for eating. Uh, there's usually small, uh, small amounts of food. Uh, I don't think they are appropriate for the Iraqi people because we are usually to eat like this. Uh, okay. We have hand sticks, <laughs> not chopsticks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, so they are called chopsticks. Okay, next conversation is box seven, conversation. Oh no. Oh no. This is what? It's not only a surprise. It's just, it is a surprise, but what kind of Why didn't I say interesting? Yeah, good. Negative surprise. Let us call it negative surprise. Shocked. I am surprised negatively. Okay. Oh no! No way! Yes. You, you tell me something unbelievably, unbelievably, unbelievable, but in a bad way. And for example, I tell you, all of you will fail in conversation. Oh no! Okay. Yeah. So you are surprised. But don't be surprised. This is something true. <laughs> okay. Oh no! Okay. Look at the picture. See, yes. two, um, look at their faces, how oh, they are, <laughs> bad face, shock, yeah. Sean, uh. okay, I want uh, Cage, Joe, and Server, three characters, two gentlemen and one lady. Uh, the lady, your name? Tari, you are Cage. Ali, Ali, you are uh, Joe. I want server. Yes. Uh, Ahmed, Ahmed, you are server. Okay, start the conversation. <laughs> Keys. Yeah. First, yeah. Thinking. Mm, no, it's not. See, I, uh, yeah. Mm, yeah. Uh, this is in my pocket. Wait, uh, a minute. Of, a minute. Of the minute. Yeah. Wait a minute. That's in. That is my wallet. 
Thank you, Ahmed. Thank you, Ali. Thank you, Tagri. Thank you for you all. Oh no! Where is my car keys? As if she has forgot your air car keys. And you know, when you are away from your home, you travel by your car and you lost your keys. Imagine what a bad situation you are in. A miserable situation. How can you come back? It's a really uh, bad surprise. And usually you say, oh no. So where are my keys? I don't know. Her husband, I think, Mr. Joe. I don't know. Are they in your purse? You know purse? What kind of bag? Handbag. Uh, any handbag, small bag, like just like used for keeping small materials, like keys, maybe money, uh, something mobile. It's different from bag. Bag is bigger than purse. Okay. You just have a look at it. It's like this. She's searching her purse. Uh, Mrs. Kate, Mrs. Kate in the picture. Uh, maybe they are in your, uh, on the table in the restaurant. At that time, a server comes. Excuse me, are these your keys? He came. He comes at the appropriate time. This time, yeah. This? Yes, they are. Thank you. You are welcome. And this is your wallet. He says to Mr. Uh, Joe, yes. your wallet. Uh, um, no, it's not. He searches his uh, suit and says, yes, yes, they are. It's in my pocket. Uh, uh, sorry? No, it's not. They are your wallet, uh, Joe. It's in my pocket. Wait a minute. He searches himself and that's, that is my wallet. See? Both of them are forgetful. Is he for, you know, forgetful? Yes. And it's Sain. <coughs> You have oblivion, you know oblivion, oblivion, <coughs> oblivion, yani. oblivion, 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 you like oblivion, you don't like, to be forgetful, nisyan, oblivion, uh, is oblivion something good or bad, bad. bad. very bad, because it, many many times puts you in embarrassing situations okay. is it bad and that's all could be dangerous dangerous okay good good what about the memory of the death of a dear one of a loved one if you keep remembering him for a long time your life is going to be a tragedy. Yes. Without oblivion, you will <coughs> die after. Right? So, the answer is now both. Oblivion is advantage and disadvantage. Yes. Yeah. Oblivion is a grace. At the same time, it's bad. It's a relative matter. Okay? So, uh, grammar focus. Again, I don't want to repeat it because it's, it's mainly about this, that, these, uh, in plural and singular. Let us jump to A, practice, to fill in the blanks. Okay, number one, I want A and B. I want A and B. Is your name? And and Leila. A, Leila, B. Umbrella, and now uh, number one is answered, already answered. Good, thanks. Thank you, uh, both of you, Leila and uh, and him. thank you. Two, yes, your name? Yeah, Safa, and? Yeah, you, yeah. Wurud, Safa and Wurud. Yes, Wurud A, Safa B. Good. Not are uh, what? These, are these, are these your glasses? You know, as if she's handling this. And the child are these your glasses? So, are these your glasses? Yes, Wurud. Yeah. 
Thanks. Mechanics. Thanks. Yes. Free. Gentlemen. Shabab. Yes, please. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Who oh, yes. is gentlemen? Uh, Ahmed and Ali. Yes, number three, Linda. <coughs> three. Conversation practice three. Where? Where are your sentences? Where are your sentences? So you know, glasses is used as a plural. Don't forget this, okay? So glasses are used as a plural. <coughs> yes, Ahmed. Yes, uh, answer, Ali. They are on the table. Good. Uh, no, uh, they are not. Good, they are not. Kemal Ahmed, Ali. They are my sunglasses. Kemal, conversation. What are you are uh, my sunglasses? No, Ali, you said no, they aren't dots. They are my sunglasses. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, my sunglasses are. Last one, last practice. Dina Hassan. Is this my pen? Is this my pen? No. So it's, it's my, my pen. pen. No, it's not. It's my pen. Hassan. You said no, it's not. It's my pen. Yeah. Is this my pen? No, it is not. It's my pen. Yeah. So this is my pen. It is on not this. Oh, right. you are right. Okay, thank you. Thank you all. Uh, group, uh, well, put your fingers in a bag, then choose three different things. Find the owner of each one. Uh, this is your pen, you go. No, it's not. Are these your keys? Um, yeah, group work. Still, I would like to later on. Okay, I, I would like to make a um, short conversation to students. One uh, selects from his pocket something, anything that the other doesn't know. And the other one asks, what is this? And his colleague answers, this is so-and-so. So who is ready to do it? And stand here. Mm -hmm. Conversation and acting. Both. Yeah. <laughs> this is nice, yeah. Yes. This is for you. Yes, Hsien and, and uh, Ahmed. OK, you planned a conversation. How to do it. Will you please stand here? And uh, say, uh, what is this? Yeah, this is something natural. Yeah. It feels shy. Can we just? Yeah, why not? Yes. Yeah. What's this? Stand here, uh, please. Stand here and say. That should be done. I'll have the last one. Acting, as yes. as you don't know. What is this? This is a court uh, thing. Yeah. No, so a white board eraser. One for the eraser or rubber. Thank you very much. Thanks a lot. Thank you very much, Hussain and Ahmed. You did a good job. Excellent.
Okay, what is it? And what is used? What is it used for? Yeah, a rubber. <laughs> Two names, rubber. And eraser. So now we come to box nine. It's uh, yeah, word power, yeah. Prepositions, article, that. You see, we have these prepositions are used for to indicate place. You know, to indicate place. To know where can I find something. We have many particles, uh, prepositions, for example, on, and, out of, in front of, of, uh, what else, under, yeah, next to, under, behind, behind, next to, to, in front of, yeah, Ah, that's enough. So, look at the picture of the box. We have keys and we have box. Look at the position of the keys. Sometimes in, sometimes on, sometimes under, behind. The first one is behind. First picture from the left. Behind means behind. Well, the whiteboard is behind me, right? You are in front of, good. I can say in front of. You are in front of me. Yes. But by the way, sometimes before, either man, kilimet before, other man not in front of. And if you say in front of or before, same, same meaning. Okay. You are before me. You are in front of me. Yes. On. You know. Sit on, the stage. on. Yeah. On, on the table. For example, the the marker is on the table. Okay. The microphone is on the table. Uh, next to, yeah, you sit next to your friend. Next to, and besides, okay. Uh, under, yeah, there's someone, something under it. See, uh, for example, we are under the, under the ceiling. We are under the ceiling. What else? Oh, by the way, the, uh, on and above. Yeah, you see, at on and above. Both means that something on something or above something. What's the difference between them? Above it means on ala ala right? What's the difference between on and above? Say uh, the book is on the table. The book is above the table. What's the difference between them? <laughs> yeah. No, it's not. It's not a matter of uh, plurality or singularity. No, a difference in meaning. A different. Yeah. See, the, the book is on the table. Okay. Clear. The book is above the table. Can you? Distinguish the difference, you know? The, the book is on the table. The book is above the table. Yes. Means what? Yes. Yes, Maybe the, the, the above? No, no, not a matter of sure. No. It's a matter of. Is the line? If someone Yeah. Good. But this is on. Yeah. Above. There is a space between these two elements, okay? Uh, we say the ceiling is above us. It's incorrect to say the ceiling is on us. On us, yani ala rosh Okay? Yes. Above us. God is above us. Yes. Not on us. Yes. On means there's a direct contact between uh, the clock is above the white whiteboard. If the clock is on, whiteboard and both the clock is on. You, you, now you see the difference? Yes, yes. Clear? Yes, yes. 
On and above, above, there's a space between these two, between two, and on, no, there's a direct contact between them. Okay? Now I would like someone to say, give me uh, use. I would like someone to use these prepositions. For example, do you sit here? Oh, my friend, my colleague, Noor, is beside next to me. My colleague, Koda, for example, is in front of me, my other friends behind me, my books are under me, and, uh, whatever. Yes, else? else yes, for that. Yeah. You, you explain. It's not a matter of asking. No need to ask. Just explain to the others yes. that I am sitting here. My colleague Dalal is next to me. My colleague Allah is in front of me. My colleague is behind me. Uh, <laughs> my books are on the chair. Uh, my books are on the chair. What else? Um, my wallet is in my bag. My pencil is in my head, yes. It's only a matter of using these prepositions. Say whatever you like. Not on, not read yourself. <coughs> okay, I will come back to you later. Thank you. Yes, Hassan. Good. Right. The window is behind you. Yes. Good. The stage. Yes. Good. In front of me. You are on the chair. On the chair. The chair is under me. Good, I'm next to the table. Yeah, thank you very much, Hassan. Good. Yes, for that. And I sit in the same classroom and Allah uh, behind the. Uh, and the. Uh, behind the. <laughs> She's uh, in front of you. Yes. Uh, and my pencil uh, is uh, in. Good, yeah. My cabinet or the desk. Right. No, the desk chair. <laughs> Thank you, this is right. Yes, other students. Yes. Here, I can, I can feel a silence. I would like to break the silence. Yes, your name, please. Yes, uh, yeah. By the way, beside next to, both are correct. Both are okay. You say beside me or next to me, it's okay. Yeah. on the chair, on the table. Thank you, Zaha. Thanks a lot. Yes, your name? Hanin. Yes. Next to back. Yes, we have a practice here. Have a look at the pictures and try to answer. The first one is already answered. The books are in the book bag. You see? It's clear. So what about the second? Cell phone, what's the meaning of cell phone? Cell phone. 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 It's movable, okay? Like me, I'm movable now. <laughs> yes, uh, yes, you? I, yes, Good, hairbrush. The cell phone is next to the hairbrush. Uh, third yes. one? Yes. yes, your name? Yeah? Sama? Sama, yes, Sama. Good. And the newspaper? Good. 
the, the map is under the newspaper, and the newspaper is on the map. Thank you. Yes, uh, your name? Yes, Mustafa. Right. Yeah. The table, the table above the chair. Under the table. Good. The table is. The chair is under the table, and the table is uh, above, above the chair. Thank you, Mustafa. Right, thank you. Yes, they do. Uh, the wallet, the wallet is yeah. on a book. Yeah. On the, the book, under the wallet. On, under the wallet, thank you, that's right. Yes, your name? Yes, Vinny? In front of the back. The, not a, the back. The French look at that. Yes. When we know which bag I mean. Yes. yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know this bag. I mean this yellow bag. But I, yeah, I used that. Okay. Yes. yes. When we use at or in front of or at one. In front of. At, no, this is something. At for time. At for time used. Okay. I, at front of. In front of. At, okay. at front? No, there is no at front. Just in at yes. at morning, for example, I will be there at morning. And at at time, yes. at Sunday, at Sunday morning, at Tuesday, on Tuesday also could be. At front of no, this is, there is nothing like that. For that. Not at front, in the front. Of. Um, here, where are the books? Where are okay earrings? Okay, listen in case things, the one, um, when the lab is ready, we are going to take lectures in the lab. listening. Did you take the CDs? Yes. With the, the book? Excellent. Okay. Yeah. Huh? Not all of them? The CD, yeah. Compact CD. There must be a compact CD with compact desk, sorry. Okay, I have it, but... Um, Next lecture, inshallah, we are going to start taking conversation lectures in the lab. Because it's very important because all of these conversations are <coughs> spoken. Yes. And we, we must listen to the right conversation, right pronunciation. So, now also have a look at the picture. Now on page 13. The big picture, yes. Uh, Mr. Joe also again is... Uh, Ah, uh, he's lost. Mr. Joe uh, has a problem. He's forgetful. He's forgetful. <laughs> so, have a look for 30 seconds. Try to examine every element in the, in the, in the picture. Because we will ask about it. Yes. Now, um, pair work. Help Joe find his things. Ask and answer questions. Now we start. There are you know, so many things in his room. He doesn't know. So we are going to try to, to help him where to find. Them. Okay. First one is a briefcase. What's the meaning of briefcase? Yes, Yunit. Okay. Yes, Ali. Hakeem. What kind of hakeem? What What's the difference between briefcase and back? By the way, we have briefcase, we have back. Both meaning. Yes, I I will come to you, please. Uh, back. Briefcase. Case. And back. Both are hakeem. Yes, yes. And the briefcase is used to keep the paper. For, for, for office works, yes. yeah, for pa yeah, yeah, keeping yeah. files, papers, pencils, for office, for office works in general. For office works. Uh, uh, for if you come to the college, sometimes maybe you could, you, you have briefcase. What about bag? This is general. Could be a sport bag, nylon bag, school bag. 
Okay? And how they shown in a co-ahad as this briefcase? This is called a briefcase. This is, give me this. Who is this briefcase? So this is uh, optional for a senior Okay? Used for uh, keeping papers, something connected to the office for study education. Okay? But bag could be paper area. Bag, nylon bag, put some in nylon, or bag of a lady, Olympia, your stuff, yeah. Okay, is it clear? So, briefcase. Briefcase is there in the picture, you see? So, now, where is his briefcase? It is on the table. Answer. Second, cell phone. Where is the cell phone? Yes. Yeah? Where is the cell phone? Good, under the table. It is under the table. Thank you, Benny. Uh, where is the newspaper? Where is his newspaper? No. This, I examine the picture carefully. We will, mm, you will know the difference between newspaper or magazine. موجودة بالصورة ماجازين نيوزبيبر ماجازين 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 Huh? Say it in English. Next to. Next to the briefcase. On the table, next to the briefcase. Hold up. What you said is right. It is on the table. Will you be next to the briefcase? Okay. So, umbrella. Where is his umbrella? Yes, your name? Ali, yes, Ali. Next to the chair. Good, next to the chair or beside the chair. Uh, is it chair? No. Come on, that's right. You, you can say chair. You can say, but it's not very much appropriate. Um, the chair. So is it the same as your chair? No, no. no. So what is it? Can you say more than X? Back a furniture, okay. Sofa, sofa, uh, big, yeah, on which one may lay his body, may he lay his legs, stretch, stretch his legs, okay. But again, it is right to say chair. No, no, armchair. Had armchair. This is armchair. The one you sit on. So uh, it is right to say chair. Okay. But general, better to say furniture, side of furniture, because it is used with sponge. There is a sponge and there is leather covered with leather. Okay. Now, camera. Where is his camera? Yes, your name, please. Yeah, you. Hello. Yeah. What up? Yes, what up? Good. Is next on the table and next to or in front of? Asah. No, before the the table. Thank you, Wala. Yes. What about the glasses? Where are Mr. Joe's glasses? He can't see now. Yes. Yes. Shabab at the end, gentlemen. Behind the, 
floor. Just uh, let me see. Ah. On. You on. The, the glasses is on. That. The what? Clock, watch hour. Clock, yes. Well, I call table clock. I'm on the table. Sahih, table. So, what about notebook? Is notebook? Yes, Hassan. Above? Yes, right. Could be. About sunglasses? No. Notebook? Notebook. Right. Could be. Right. Above. Next to the plant. The front. Okay. Tell me where is his notebook? Tell me. According to the picture. In front of the clock, right? Yes. Above the cat. Also right because it is above. Next to. Next to. What? Plant. Planet. You mean? Should I write it? Hey, planet. Next to the planet, I show you the eight. Planet. Hey. Okay. Wallet. What about the wallets? Now, Mr. Joe is without money because he has lost his wallet. So please help him to. Okay, sir. Yes. Under under the chair. Yeah. Next to the side. Good, yeah. It's not called recycle. That's right. Um, it's under the chair, on the carpet, and next to recycle bin. Should windows not excellent? Low speed. Recycle bin, that's not the most important thing to do. Recycle. I'm going to look at recycle bin. This is electronic term. Does it mean this? A كلمه cycle دورة ريسايكل إعادة تدوير يعني هذه ممكن الريسايكل بن بن يعني يعني بن اوكي يعني هي ال... هي البن الموجودة في البن اوكي آه هذه ممكن تستعيد ترجع منها شايف المحذوفات ريسايكل تطبلها ترجع بس ما ريسايكل بن وايل ذيس ذيس از نوت ريسايكل طلع منها و... Uh, you, you throw what you don't need. Right? You don't think to, to take it back. So what is it called? Yes. Yeah. Garbage right. Uh, the most appropriate. Yani. Garbage here, not a trash. What's up? Is it here? Could be garbage right. What? Waste basket. Waste basket. Yeah. Waste basket. No waste, waste, mumalat, waste baskets, mumalat, oh, uh, dust basket also. Basket also, okay. So it is next to the waste basket under his wallet, under the, the, <coughs> the chair, next to the waste basket on the carpet. Uh, what about the cat? The cat is sleeping along. On the furniture, yes, on the furniture. What about, let us ask more questions about. Look at the picture and ask. There are other elements that we didn't ask about. The lamp, what about the lamp? The magazine. Magazine on the ground. Keys, good, yeah, the keys is in his wife's hands. In his wife's hands. Uh, the gate. Yeah, I don't think someone can lose the, the gate. The door. This is called door, not gate. What's the difference between gate and door? Gate. We have gate. We have. Uh, gate and door. But you must distinguish between them. Uh, gate. Door. Yes, Hassan. Old. Old. Good. It's bigger than the door. Bigger than the door. I usually used with old terms, right? 
was not necessarily old. And he had it as a gate. It's bigger. And you cannot say the, the gate of your home. Yeah? The, the main gate. You cannot call it door. It's called gate. Okay? But the door is a small, a small one. So this is called door, not gate. Clear? The gate of a palace, the main gate, the gate of a castle, the gate of the hospital, old gate, okay? Because, so I don't think Mr. Joe uh, has lost the gate, the door. <laughs> okay, now, uh, so I have How much progress uh, we have gained? Okay, we must check check ourselves before taking the unit and after taking the units. So it is a matter of assessment, self assessment. You know assessment? Uh, yes. In English. Uh, in English. Yes, yes Dalal. Like Again? System. system? Yeah. No, not system. It is a system, but what kind of system? <laughs> Test, evaluation. Yes, Huda. Evaluation. Okay, assessment. You evaluate time to, to measure the progress that you have gained. So, let us evaluation. Exchange contact information, example, phone numbers. What is your phone number? Say 0101, zero one zero one. okay. Yes. Understand names for everyday objects and possessions. Uh, I think we've taken names of males and females. Uh, objects, you know, objects like earrings. What is, what is it called? What is this? How do you so all about the names of objects? Okay. <coughs> Ask and answer questions about where things are. The end will above will on. Where things are? Where are they? Okay. How are you? Number one. Complete the conversation. New sentences and questions in box. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. Thanks. Uh, hi. Revision. Okay. Revision. Practice the conversation from part A. Use your own information. Introduce your partner to a classmate. Melina, this is my friend, his name is Titsu. This is your phone number, so and so. Class activity, write your uh, phone number on a piece of paper, then put the papers in the back. Take a different paper and find the owner, uh, write his or her name on the paper. Ali is your phone number, okay? This is an activity, I think we should stop here. Next lecture, God willing, um, I'll ask a question. Put your, this in your mind about conversation, okay? Prepare yourself. It's a simple <coughs> test, okay? Let us call it simple test. Well, a quiz more for Mago than a quiz, then. No quiz, no quiz, and it's a surprise. You don't expect it, again. That's why I call it test. You know, why I mentioned it? Because I said, 
حاضر جالس لكم كويز انت تقول لنا كويز هو الكويز اصلا لو تدخلون المعنى مالته sudden test sudden test you don't expect that today you are going to be examined so it's called quiz yeah, about uh, unit one and two okay usually hey yes yeah, stop here any question please yes Sam. yes sir what's the what is the difference not different yes what's the difference again what the difference? What about you and uh, how about you? What about you? How about you? Uh, if I say, for example, uh, I will go to the party tonight, what about you? Or uh, how about you? Okay. Both the questions yes. are seeking answers from the listener. Yeah. Give me, how about you? Yeah. Can you yeah. come with me? Are you ready? How? This is yes. how. Yeah. You want me to for example, I say, how are you? And are you? I'm asking about your health or your conditions, your... What about you? Are you ready? A slight difference. But how? And are you? Are your conditions ready? Or back and just how about you? What about you? Just a slight difference. Maybe he has another... He has. He has another... Yeah. Situation. Both are... Right, but are correct actually. If there is a difference, there is a small, very slight difference. How about you? What about you? How is it clear? I mean, is it is everything okay for you to come? What? Not necessarily asking about what is, is more general than how. I think what what is more general about everything, but how? Uh, asking about whether you are ready or not. Yes. What is, is general more comprehensive? Could be. But again, but again, Hussein, uh, they are very same. Yeah. Yes, please welcome.